Hey everybody, it's Blue Toad, and welcome back to Pokemon Scarlet. And now, we're able to dash with Crydon to run faster, which is very cool. Wasn't what I was expecting to get from that, but it is going to be very helpful for going around fast. Very fast. So let's take a look at what we can do over this way. I tried to grab item and it didn't work. That's another thing. I can, I can go back and get the other item. That seems like a lot of a lot of work going back up that one spot. But I mean, we can run, dash now, so it shouldn't be that long to get up there. If I just run for it. He, he, ha, ho. Oh, almost there. E. Hello. He's just chilling. Stop. Okay. There's also another item up here. That wasn't here before. It's a revive. Nice, I used one of those, so... It's good to have another one back. And a Max Aether. I also see that over there. Can I make that jump? Probably not. I mean, I can I can, I can go faster now, but... Not fast enough to make that jump work, so... I'm zooming. I do be zooming. Just trying to get up, please. It's fine. There it is. Okay, let's see what this is. This is... Poison type something. I think it's something we've already fought before. Possibly. Based on the shape, so... I'm just gonna leave that then. Oh, hello Pokemon. I'm just gonna... Do that quickly. We're not battle you. Manually. I think I get more XP if I actually do battle properly though. But it's just faster to do it like this, I think. Anyway. Back on the road. Let's fight another trainer. The treasure hunt is so much fun. I'm doing the treasure hunt too, and no fresh face kid is gonna beat me. Your face is fresh. Christina the student. Sent out Ghastly, okay. Let's see, what can we do here? Bite is super effective, so Dark is good. Also, physical moves won't have any effect on Ghost-type Pokémon. I don't think, so... Can't use something that's gonna physically attack them. Like Tackle. Murkrow? I guess I'll stay with current Pokémon. I don't know what I'm doing. Bite? I think it's a dark type, so it's not it's definitely gonna be effective like that. It did make it flinch though, which is good. Let's use Ember. That's better. Wasn't resistant to that, so. And there we go. If that's how you battle, I'm sure you'll be able to find your treasure. Cool, thank you. Well, off we go. We, we we do be zooming. Another trainer. Come say hi, come say hi! Yeah, you came! So, w want a battle? Battle? A mayor the student. Sent out happening. Also, I'm looking at the mountain in the background, and that's really cool. Just to see from here. Just look at it. I know there's a lot of complaints about this game, but also that view is good. It's a good view. Especially with like the the water running down. The river. The waterfalls. I assume that's what that is. Not just random bits of ice on the side. Or just towels or something, I don't know. You battle really good. Cool, thank you for telling me how good I am at the Pokemon. Because I'm not, I'm not usually this good. But I'm over leveled, so that helps. Grab that. Another Hyper Potion, very nice. I'll slow down. 
have to let go of the control stick to slow down. Also, is that what I think it is? Guard spec. What are you? It's not what I thought it was, but this seems interesting. Or Auric a I don't know. I might have. Yeah, I might have got that right. I think. Oh, let's just tackle it. Okay. Use Growl to lower my attack. Just gonna tackle again. And maybe throw a Pokeball now. Do it. Do it good. Nope. It did bad. Use Peck. Can I use Round? Okay, that's, that's as close as it's going to get. Pokeball. One, two, three, and caught. Very nice. Now, five flying. Interesting. Let me send that to the boxes. I like that that combination of types for that. Flyer and f f fire and flying. Just seems cool. So is that another Pokemon that I haven't seen yet? I think so. So let's catch one of these. Another bird. Imitate. Im 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 immediate? No. Oh. Uh, let's use bite. Okay, bite again. Use Mimic. It learned bite. At least for this battle, but it's not gonna last long, so. Use Pokeball. Because I think um that one that the move that it used will become whatever move it copies for the rest of the fight, possibly. I would imagine that's how that works, so. Ross wants to learn Psybeam. Haven't used that, that that one much, so. Once we get, forget Draining Kiss, we can do that. There we go. And now let's up to another town. Or, yeah. Normal Flying. This looks like a really cool town as well. Once we actually get into it. And not another fight. Hang on. I know what to do. Be overpowered, that's what. We're right next to a Pokemon Center, so I might as well. I've been too hesitant on using the Terrestrialize ability. Yeah, please don't go down. Burn. 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 We did it. Worth it. Very much worth it. Anyway, here's another town. So let's go ahead and use the Pokemon Center so we can register it. Now we can come back here anytime we want to. I guess I should also go back to the other Pokemon Center because I've broken- I've probably fought six trainers now. Definitely, so. Terra Orbs are recharged as well. Very nice. There's also these vending machines right here that we should probably be using if possible. Also, is that an item in that- no, it's not in the tree, it's on top of the thing, okay. Not entirely crazy. I'm crazy, but not entirely. Nine trainers out of six. Get a shell bell. Very nice. The holder restores a little HP to itself every time it inflicts damage with an attack. Cool. That's a good one to have. Let me 
see. Where would I put that in my bag? Probably here. Uh, let's give the shell bell. Who do I want to restore HP? I don't know. I'll just give it to one of them. It's not that crazy to have right now, but it's gonna be good to have. We also have some extra XP I could spend on my Pokemon as well. So let's use some of these. How many do you want to use? Three? Extra small? I think that's what that is. That doesn't actually give as much as I thought it might, so I'm gonna do a bit more than that. I'll give it a thousand XP. Which means that it's how much per extra small? I didn't see. It's gone. Hang on. Give me a second. I'll find out. It doesn't even say. Cool. That's how little the extra small gives. Uh, let me just do a bit of this. There we go. And that's enough for Whooper to evolve. Oh my goodness, look at him. It's incredible. Clod Sire. Ground Poison. Still, so. But that's incredible. <laughs> Look at that artwork. Wants to learn Amnesia. It's a psychic type move. Sharply raises the user's special defense. I don't really need that. But it wants to forget Toxic Spikes, which is only... It's only Poison type move, which would be good for trainer battles, probably, if I used it. I think I'll get rid of Tail Whip, because I'm not going to use that, so... I don't think. There we go, though. Now let me spend a bit more of this to bring all of my Pokémon up to 20. The S Candy, which gives... 800. Also, Routes is le leveled up enough to evolve now. Evolved into... Curlia. Very nice. We're definitely getting some of these Pokémon. <laughs> Doing a good job of getting everything. Ah, uh, let's just go a little bit more. For you. Probably only need one. Level 20, is that... Nope, it's not high enough to evolve. I don't know if, what, if it needs a special item to evolve, or if it evolves at all. I don't actually know, so... Guess that's good enough for now, though. Now let's head back to the city, probably. I can also see where the ruins are on the map, which is interesting. I should keep that, uh, keep that in mind. There's one over there, but I don't know if I can get up there. Where that is. Also, we're up to... Another gym, already. It's a grass type. I didn't realize it was right there. There's a Starfall Street quest there as well. Guess it would be good, a good idea to do the next gym so we can get more stuff. Just unlock more, more abilities, probably. Don't have to worry about my Pokemon leveling up too, hu too high. Let me just check my team. Good. But this looks like a really cool town here. It's got all these flowers. It's very, um... I don't know what the- I can't remember what the place is, but it's- <laughs> Like, all these flowers in the- The design of it is very, um... Yeah, I can't remember what it's called. <laughs> if you know what it's called, please... I don't know. I should know. But it's fine. I'm surprised we're already at the next gym, to be honest. I would've thought it'd be further away. Veya, Jeremy! It's so wild that we ended up randomly visiting the same gym at the same time, again! What a weird coincidence. 
I swear, I'm not just sneaking ahead of you so I can lie in wait and go, Oh wow, weird, might as well battle now that you're here. No, seriously, look, to prove it, I won't even challenge you to a battle this time. Much as I'd like to. But look at your, you and your Pokemon. They're definitely gotten stronger, stronger since last time. Add these to the mix and you'll be 100% set to go, no problem. Got some ethers. I'll be cheering for ya. I'll go train, like, maybe 20 Pokemon or so while you tackle the gym. That's a lot of Pokemon to be training all at once. Welcome to the Artisan Gym. Let me register you as a challenger. Your name is Jeremy, yes? Great, now, in order to face gym leader... Brassius? Brassius? Br I do You'll first need to pass the gym test. Here at the Artisan Gym. That means completing a game of Sunflora Hide and Seek. As you know, Artisan is a city of artists. The artwork made by the people here is, uh, is largely inspired by nature and the sun that in na na nurtures it. Since Sunflora embody these concepts, we try to gather them and take good care of them. Your job for uh, today is to find the Sunflora located throughout Artisan. Remember, these Pokemon look like sun sheep flowers. Gather up 10 of them and bring them to the Sunflora lawn, and you pass the test. I'll register the Sunflora's lawn's uh, location in your map app to get you started. When you leave the gym, turn right and you'll see two large Sunflora statues. Head for those. Once you're at the lawn's entrance, the staffer there will tell you more about the gym test. Now, go, get out there and have fun. The gyms are certainly interesting. I'm I'm so used to just going in and fighting trainers though, and then fighting the gym gym leader. Not just go play a mini game and then do, do the gym leader. Ah, uh, so where is that? It's, it's it's somewhere. Oh, there. Okay. <laughs> like right there. I thought it was going to be further away. Ready to gather up some sunflora? Hi there, I look after the Artisan's Gym Sunflora. I hope you're ready, Challenger. It's time for a game of Sunflora Hide and Seek. I'll go ahead and ask the Sunflora to spread themselves out around town. Interesting. Sounds like the Sunflora are ready for you. With that, your gym test has now begun. Once you've found 10 Sunflora, please bring them back here to the Sunflora lawn. That's all from me now. Good luck out there. Here we go, I guess. So I guess we don't have to worry about a time limit on this, so we can take our time probably. I don't know. I don't know where to look. I don't even know where to. Be I don't know where to begin. I think this is just a statue, right? Surrounding Sunflora, a work of Brassus. Okay. So I don't know if they are. I think are they? Oh, this, that one's definitely one. You found a Sunflora. The Sunflora will now follow you around. That's cool. So if they're moving <laughs> and not looking like a statue, they co look completely different. Wait, are these... Are these the one I'm, I'm supposed to be finding? Yes, they, they count. So why are they right there? I don't know. Anyway. There's one. Nope have to check them to actually get them. I think? Wait, I'm battling. Why am I battling? This is fine, probably. Round. You have a weird frame rate thing right now, and I'm not sure why. Let me look closer. Like, I can see those frames. Maybe that's intentional, I don't know. Now, I don't know if I can catch this, is the other thing. I probably should check that, because I'm trying to catch it right now. But if I'm not supposed to catch it, I'm just supposed to defeat it, then it would make more sense to, uh... 
just use a stronger move. I really should have checked at the beginning of the fight. Can I please have my turn now? No, I'm just supposed to take it out, okay. I was going easy on you, but now that I know, it's super effective. Thank you for the XP during a gym task. Wants to learn Snarl. Which Pokemon is this? Oh, interesting. Snarl is a dark type move. It has 55 power and 95 accuracy. Uh, and lowers the special attack of the opposing Pokemon. Uh, okay. I guess I'll get rid of Tackle for that because we have had Tackle for a long time, but we don't need it anymore, I don't think so. It'd just be good to have a move with some kind of typing. Instead of just a normal type move. So I'll take that with me. And now that's five Sunflora? Yes. Cool. I think that's another one over here. Good thing I spotted that. Okay, that's six. I don't know how far around town they are. But I guess I'll just keep looking. Just gonna watch very closely everything around me. Everything. I feel like they're not gonna be up this far. Never mind. There's one. Okay, so are there more in this maze then? Yes, is the answer. Seven, eight. I just want to go grab this item. I don't know if I can grab it during this time, but I'm going to check. I can. Guard spec. This kid looks very disappointed. I don't know why. I think there's one in there. So I'm going to have to go through this quite a bit. Hopefully I can't lose these behind me. I don't think I can. They're teleporting, so... That's nine. There might even be more than ten. Just around. But I think... No, that's just that. Oh, but there's that one there. There we go. All ten. Time to bring them back to the Sunflora Lawn. Might also see if there's another item. Which there is. So let's grab that. Poison trait. Po no, poison tail. Interesting. Not trail. Tail. Have to make sure I'm getting that right. This is a weird way to do gyms. <laughs> I'm not against it, but it's... I'm just so not used to it. <laughs> Look at all these boys following me. Look at them all. So many. I passed. Well done on finding all these Sunflora. You passed the gym test with flying colors. Now please head back to the lobby at the Artisan Gym to report your result. Okay, if you say so. Well, it's not that far to walk, so that should be easy enough. It seems you successfully gathered 10 Sunflora and brought them over to the Sunflora Lawn. That means you've cleared the gym test. Congratulations. Now, you've now earned the right to challenge the gym leader. Best of luck. Are you ready to challenge gym leader Bra Brassius? The verdant... Vertioso? Sure. Very well, allow me to show you the bat... Ba to show you to the battle court. I feel like there's a lot of words that I inserted unnecessarily. <laughs> it's fine. I'm fine. I just can't read. I'm more I'm more worried about reading than I am about the gym battle. Greetings, challenger. Humph.
You did well to come this far. I am Brassius, an artist specializing in grass type Pokemon. I am also the gym leader here at the Artisan Gym. I was observing your gym test from atop the windmill, you know. Their perception uh, you displayed in Fighting Sunfloor was truly... Oh, how shall I describe it? Yes, it was truly avant-garde. Gard, garde? Oh. Avant garde. Got, got, I don't know. I only p pray that you might demonstrate that eye for beauty in all our battle as well. Enough talk. We must begin creating our collaborative work of art. I'm gonna destroy you. <laughs> I trust that you are ready. It is time for our masterpiece to take shape. Pet a, pet, pet a lily. I don't know. I think that's... yeah. Okay. Artist creation and destruction. Struggle is else your defeat will nourish my Pokemon. Okay, well I'm gonna Terrestrialize right away. Because that should just last for the rest of the fight. And it's gonna make this a lot easier probably. You could probably just not use it at all in the game to give yourself a... Trying to even things out a bit. I mean, you can only use it once between Pokemon centers, so. But yeah, I think I correct. I picked the the type easiest starter Pokemon probably for these gym battles. At least these first two. Although you can do in, probably do them in any order, so. Super effective. Just absolutely blowing everything away. Pseudo Wudo. This has promise. Yes, let us lead this artistic endeavor to its conclusion at once. I'm glad I'm actually able to keep up with some of this. I don't think this is a. Yeah, there we go. Allow me to touch this work up slightly. I call it. Tr tr truly pseudo wudo. Is it finally going to be a grass type? Finally. After all these years of confusion. Of it being actually a rock type or whatever it is. Is it finally a grass type? Well, here we go. It was about a grass type for about two seconds, so. It was, it was a good two seconds, so it's actually going to last five seconds. That's cool. Because it's sturdy. Right. At times, art becomes a race against the clock. Let us increase the pace. Trailblaze. It only survived for longer than two seconds because of its ability. Anyway. Let's finish it off. I do like the gym battle, like, cheering stuff in the background. It's nice and cool. There we go. Let's see, what do I want to replace with Yawn? Lulls the target into sleep next turn. Sharply boosts the special def and what do you want to get rid of? Toxic spikes? I really want to keep toxic spikes though. I think I could actually get rid of an amnesia, to be honest. Boost the user's special defense. Um, I guess I could change them later probably as well, so I'll just do this for now. One, two, and ta-da! You defeated the gym leader, Barassus. Avant guard! He seems mad. In more ways than one. Oh, what artistic tactics you employ. The patterns of your moves, the minute, uh, minute details of your Pokemon's performance. Everything you did was honored to, perf uh, to perfection. Our battle was, in a word, art. 
Indeed, if we could not call that a work of artistry, then nothing else in this world could be labelled as such. Well, that's a shame, isn't it? If I were to judge your work, I would say it passes my inspection. Yes, a pass without exception. As proof of your artistic pr prowess, you may have uh, my gym badge. Shall we take a photo as well? I like that he wants to take a picture with me for this. That's cool. Anyway, that's our second gym badge. If you possess two gym badges, it will be easier to catch Pokemon up to level 30, and those Pokemon should follow your commands as well. To a fantastic trainer such as, such as yourself, I would also like to offer this, my a favorite of mine. TM20 Trailblaze. Ah, my inspiration is overflowing, as if drawn from a bottomless well. I will begin on a new piece of uh, piece at, at once. You must excuse me. Farewell. Goodbye. I like that he called it an, an, that battle an art because I just terrestrialized at the beginning of the fight and completed it in four moves, basically, just doing the same one each time. Pardon me, would you be the Jeremy I've been hearing so much about? Nimona had mentioned there was a promising new face in the academy. Yes, indeed. Oh, but I apologize. I didn't mean to startle you by addressing you so suddenly. My name is Hazel. I'm one of the Elite Four of the Pokemon League. I also teach art classes at the academy. So, do tell me, young Jeremy, what compels you to collect these gym badges and strive to be a champion? Uh, my friend asked me to... <laughs> Kinda. Asked and answered, thank you. Naturally, there is no single correct answer. All paths lead to the great creator of Paldia, as they say. You know, your friend Nimona is the youngest to achieve champion rank in all Paldia, Paldia history. It is entirely possible that such great potential lies within you as well. Should you continue st striving to reach champion rank, you will one day have to battle me. You would be wise to train hard, starting now. It will save you from experiencing the bitter regret of defeat. Oh, and do come along to my art class sometime. I would be thrilled to have you attend. Well, there we go. Another gym complete. But anyway, that is it for now. So thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time. And also art classes available now, so... More classes!